My first love was, and always will be, musical theater. <laughs> God, no. <laughs> this guy's fucking nuts! After examining that creature you once called Charlotte, I made a fascinating discovery. These aliens, they, they possess a highly specialized gland that allows them to communicate through rhythmic frequencies. They're drawn to music, like a moth to the flame. No, 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 no. Please, don't fucking do please. it, don't you fucking do it! <laughs> This is humanity's 11th hour. <laughs> and I've prepared something for the occasion. Oh, no, 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 God. No, 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 no. It's a show-stopping number, a real show-stopping a show-stopping number, come on. Something to shock them, to bring them a crawling, a big time box office draw. With the press and the glamour, we'll kill the review spotlight on Mr. Ingenue. So feel up your tumbler, got a show stopping number for you. Please, Professor, if they hear us, they will kill us! A show oh, stopping number is something you die for, a real catchy, earwormy tune. An award winning score that seeps in and out of your pores, a ditty to make the chorus girl swoon. It'll unify humanity in a thundering chorus. No exits from this Broadway venue. So crash those shiny symbols. Got a show stopping him no for you. This song's pretty good, huh? I bet you didn't know I was also a composer. In fact, while I've been preparing for the apocalypse, I've also been writing my own musical. <laughs> Do you mind if I give you the pitch? We don't have time. Fucking go for it. <laughs> it's called Workin' Boys, a new musical. It's the story of a group of old college chums, sure. They found success in the business world, but still, they long for the simpler times in that beat-up old house at the edge of college campus. But those glory days, they're gone for good. Or are they? <laughs> this here, this is the title number. This is called I'm up to my ass and shit. What's this business? Markets are crashing and I'm at the edge of my wits. I just can't take it when all I want to do is spend that day with Craig and Steve and Stu and Mark and Layton and Chad and ring ring the phone rings I answer it. <laughs> oh, hey, Greg. I'm swamped with business. Stocks, bonds, golden parachutes. Remember those days on the football field, Greg? Last week feels like ages ago. <laughs> Today, after work, on the football field, the old stomping ground, hey, Greg? <laughs> Just you and me 
and Steve and Stu and Mark and Layton and Chad. Five o'clock. I'll see you then, Greg. I'll see you then. All I want to do is spend that day with Steve. And five o'clock can't come soon enough. Five o'clock can't come soon enough. Five o'clock can't come soon enough. I can't wait to get home to my boys. A show-stopping number. A real show-stopper. An aria to rule them all. They'll throw us their money at full price admission. The world will come crumbling down. Hamilton will move over. Your new competition's in town. Hey, Henry. <gasps> Greg. Is it really you? No, Professor, that's not Greg. Been a long time. <laughs> hey, boys. You ready to toss around that pig skin? Stu, you have an age today. Can it be five o'clock already? It must be. Come on, Henry. We got some catching up. Working boys, we're out to the last What is this business? Five o'clock can't come soon enough. Five o'clock can't come soon enough. Five o'clock can't come soon enough. I can't wait to get home to my boys. Okay, guys, I'm here. Oh. Shh, we gotta get out of here while they're distracted. Oh my god, should I take this chair? Yes. I'll get the piano. <laughs>